Waves over on Magic 107.7. And we actually have a little bit of rain making its way through portions of the area this morning, but we're actually seeing some clear skies to the north and west, clouds to the south and east, and we're actually kind of seeing that clearing line on our Holton camera this morning. So great shot out of Holton, I think. You can see the flags blowing around this morning. We do have a stronger southerly breeze in place right now, and that's going to pick up in intensity later this afternoon. It is helping to keep our temperatures on the more mild side to start off with today. So we're at 68 now at 620 this morning in Topeka. Dew points are coming up too, thanks to that southerly breeze, so dew point at 60 right now. And we may get a little bit of rain up towards southern Shawnee County here in a little bit too. Future winds through this afternoon, about 15 to 20 miles per hour out of the south and west this morning. This is sustained winds. By the time we get to this afternoon, probably picking up a little bit, we could see some wind gusts about 35 miles per hour today, and that'll be right ahead of our next cold front. So that slides through overnight tonight and into early tomorrow, shifting our winds to the north and west, and it's still going to be breezy on Wednesday. Same goes for Thursday as well as our wind speeds are probably going to pick up a little bit more for Thursday afternoon. Now behind this cold front, we're going to have some more dry air in place, and that is going to increase our fire danger along with these gusty winds. Uh, keep that in mind for tomorrow and Thursday. Temperatures are in the low to mid 60s to start with this morning. Later on this afternoon, we'll warm up into the middle 80s for many spots. Heading into tonight, a little bit cooler as that cold front passes through, and it's going to depend on uh, how quickly we can clear this cloud cover out, how cool we get. But we could see some overnight lows in the upper 50s to low 60s, mid 70s, I think, for highs coming up for tomorrow. Satellite and radar, we have a few of those light showers coming up into our southeastern counties, but already seeing that coming to an end, unfortunately. Quick look at future track here starts at 7 a.m. Few showers gets out of here really fast, and we'll be looking at clearing skies later today. Overnight, though, as that cold front moves through, we'll be watching for those showers and storms to start developing, and hopefully we can get some uh, heavy rain out of some of those for some locations. I think for the most part, we may be looking at maybe a quarter to a half inch of rain uh, if we're lucky. There's been some model discrepancies still, even this morning. Uh, some models giving us hardly anything at all, so everybody just uh, send some positive vibes that those showers and storms uh, come through for tonight. Yes. Overall, though, we get a little bit warmer heading into Friday and Saturday. Yeah, if it wakes me up 